Hello, my darling. How you doing? I received an email today from a, a Pisces woman who wants me to give her a personal reading, and I said I would. But she wants me to do it online. Mm -hmm. And of course, not to mention her name or what she's all about. And I wouldn't do that anyway, my dear. But you wanted your personal reading online? So oh, here we go. Okay, Pisces. Personal reading for Pisces. We're going to do a Celtic cross to begin with. From there, we're going to see if we can clarify some things. But you know what? I need my eyeballs. I was thinking, what's missing? My eyeballs are missing. There we go. Hey, I can see you. Okay, babes. Pisces. Personal reading. Thank you for your email, hon. I appreciate it. Let's go. Let's get her on. Get her done. Without even looking at the cards, the first thing I feel is prosperity. Money, babes. Money. First thing that comes up is there's a decision for you to make. This decision is not in love. Matter of fact, I don't see love here at all right now. The decision you're afraid to make this decision. There's a woman coming to you with an offer. She's a fire sign. She wants you to take a leap. But you're afraid that you got a feeling that it's it, it's not worth taking the leap for. I'm going to say to take it, take that leap, now the Ace of Wands, everybody looks at that as a phallic symbol, I don't know how they get that, I really don't. Because it's a, a stick, you know, some guy holding up a stick, you know. I don't see a phallic symbol here. The Ace of Wands is a triumph. It's a triumph over something. In your recent past, there has been deception. There has been heartache, sorrow, just recent. There probably still is, which is why you're putting yourself into your work more, putting yourself into you more. You made a decision, and the decision you made All your intuition was going off. We Pisces are very intuitive. And the best thing you can do is listen to it. 
because it's hardly ever wrong. Pisces are extremely, extremely magical that way. So girlfriend, I see that you cut this off. You brought the hammers down. If by chance that this hasn't happened yet, it's coming quickly, very quickly. Let's see if we can get some more cards. I don't know who this woman is that's going to advance you soon with an offer that you're deciding, oh, I don't know, it, it, it sounds too good to be true, and I don't know, girlfriend. Yeah, I would go for it. I would read the fine print. Making the decision. Get a few more cards out here. Put these together. Yeah. I've got the full card. You're taking the leap. You're taking the leap. With the help of a woman who is a fire sign and a message from a man who is a fire sign. After receiving the message of prosperity, good news, Right after that, I see you making the decision. And now you're going for it. You're taking that leap. Uh, and money, right? <laughs> I don't know if all jokers have this. <laughs> There's a money sign there in the corner, if you can see that. <laughs> I've never noticed it before. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> Now I see that there's something bothering you. There's something bothering you here. But it's not about... It's not about this business, this offer. It's about a personal problem. young woman and a young man. Some, someone that you love, a couple, a couple that you love. There's an air sign, a female. I see talk, talk. Not nice talk, backstabbing. But nobody's saying anything to you. But being a Pisces, you know, because things don't feel right. Things don't feel right. Keep on, girl. Keep on. Keep on. Don't stop.
in your recent past, there's an air sign. This air sign is coming forward with a gift. A gift of love. But it's shallow. It's a guy from the past. It's shallow. It's it's a deceiving. I, I can't live with you, I can't live without you, and I'll do whatever I can to get you back in my life so I can treat you like crap again. Shallow, shallow man. Keep doing you. Because your money's coming, babe. Your money's coming. Yeah. You're all up in hammers and you're all up in swords, but you're not stopping. No matter how much hurt is coming your way, you're not stopping. You're like, okay, sticks and stones can break my bones. But you will never stop me from doing this. Never. Well, girlfriend, I don't know what you're into. Or what's coming for you. Holy. Yeah. It was a rough start. Oh my God, we're prospering. We are prospering. It was a rough start. A lot of indecision, a lot of, oh, I don't know, I'm scared, and a lot of bullshit from this young man and woman, whoever they are, they're married, and a lot of bullshit from the ex coming back with fake offers, and you have had the ability to stand and say, no, no. Your ships are coming in, babe. Okay. I'm going to fold them. I'm going to do another read. We're just going to more or less verify I don't like to do just one read and send it out. I like to do two or three reads just to make sure that what I see is what I see. So let's go. So you see, that's amazing. They're going to throw stones at you for a while, babe, until you make it. Then they're going to be all smiles. Then they're all going to be your friends. And you know what? You've got such a loving and big heart that you will forgive them. You will. Because your heart is so big, you will forgive them. Forgive them for their traitorous words, for their backstabbing. Bring them back in your life. Okay, darling. Let's get her on. Let's get her done. Let's go, darling. See what we got. I'm not going to do a Celtic cross. I'm going to do a Shar Reed. Kids, the fire sign with the ten cups full. She's coming to make an offer of something. You're in doubt. 
you're in doubt. It sounds too good to be true. You're excited. But you're in doubt. But it sounds really, really good. Like, oh man. This sounds really, really good. I'm going to make a decision. I'm going for the gold. I'm going for the cash. I'm going for the greatness. I'm going for me. I'm doing me. Stones are coming. Stones are starting to be cast. Judgmental people. Judgmental. Oh, how could she? Who does she think she is? And I see... You know. Nobody has said anything to you. Nobody. You know, you know, you're going to pack up your six swords, you're going to get in your rowboat, and you're going to turn your back on all of them, all of them. You made a decision. You can all talk, you can all do this, and you can all do that, I'm doing me. I don't give a damn who likes it, who doesn't, but it hurts, it still hurts. Now the money is coming in, and we've got a message, it hurts. You're going alone. You're going on a wing and a prayer. You poor thing. You don't have a friend. You have nothing. You've lost everything. But you're going for the money. You're going for you. While you're doing this, there are moments of grief. I miss them. I miss them. Maybe I should stop. Maybe I should. Maybe you shouldn't. You know you shouldn't. It's going to be a rough go, babe. It's going to be a rough go. But the people that are involved in this project, they support you. Without them, you be, you would lose it. You would lose it. You'd be wrapped up in your blankie and on your couch and mopping up the floor. And but you're willing to risk everything for this. And the reason that you're willing to risk it is because you know you're aiming for greatness. I don't know what this is. Nobody wants you to do it. Nobody. You've thrown it out there to a couple of people. They, oh, no, no, don't, don't, don't do them to that. No, 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 no. No. Because they're jealous. Because they know you'll excel. They're jealous. And real friends, don't be jealous over, over real friends. 
they urge them on and they say yes go for it I got your back go for it but if they turn against you for something you want to do that ain't no friend that ain't no friend that's an enemy your money's coming in holy shimoli you're a star babe you're a star I don't know what you're getting into it's coming soon there's an offer coming real soon I don't know what you're getting into but there's people involved and they will be the ones that will give you support while everyone that you've known for years years will turn their back on you it'll hurt but you don't give a damn let it hurt let it burn because I know I know I'm going the right way and they'll be back They'll be back. Darling, I don't know what you're into. You're headed for greatness. Kicking stars, babe. Kicking stars. Stars will bow down to you. Whatever you're into, Pisces. Whatever's coming. Make your decision. They'll all walk away from you. But your family will be here in this project. Your family, they will become your family. They will back you 100%. They will do more for you than your friends did. They will do more for you. If you cry, they'll uphold you. They will feel your pain. And man, you're going to, you're just going to get into a rocket ship, girlfriend. You're just going to blast into space, man. I'm telling you, unbelievable. But, it will hurt. And you know it'll hurt. It's okay, darling. Just don't forget who your friends are. <laughs> don't forget who your friends are beautiful reading beautiful wow that's a great reading babe sad but you know what there are many greats in the world that have lived many greats People thought they were nuts. People thought, he's gone mad. They lost everything and everyone for their belief, for their project. Look how great they became. Girlfriend, it's an amazing read. You go, Pisces. Namaste, darling. Namaste.